day controlling a panic attack. A very simple and effective technique to give you back control. If you're new here, please do consider subscribing as I produce shows daily Monday through to Friday. But now, headphones on, just close your eyes. Think about your breathing. If you're currently struggling, if your breathing is super fast, this is normal for this moment, or if you're learning this for later, be aware, anxiety, panic attacks, hyperventilation, they are normal, natural occurrences that affect practically everyone. You are perfectly safe. No physical harm will come to you from these panic attacks. At worst, your fingers might feel tingly. Severe, your fingers and hands won't be able to move, but you are not dying. Yes, you can breathe. It may be rapid, but you can breathe. What I would like you to practice is count your breathing and every third breath just hold it for a count of three. You can do this. You may feel this is out of your abilities, but when you try it won't be. Your panting will slow. It will take 5, 10, maybe 15 minutes for all the sensations that have built up to completely fade. And during this process, your breathing may speed up again. But these are small, crests on the way to recovery and control. So just try it now. Close your eyes. Count your breathing and on the third count, stop. At the top of the in-breath, hold it for a count of three. Then as you breathe out, slow that third out breath down and keep repeating this simple yet powerfully effective process. Do not berate yourself if sometimes you don't on the third or the fourth. Remember you are learning a new technique, but with practice, with understanding why this happens, you will control it. Even now, with all of my mindfulness, I still get that first hint of panic. I simply close my eyes tell myself, I am in control, and it subsides. Every third breath, hold it for a count of three, but feel free to extend this count to four or five, as the panic subsides. Repeat in your mind, I am perfectly safe.
just relax now. And at the back of your mind, you may ask, does this really work? That would be a normal human response. My caveat is, 20 years as a paramedic, I have used this technique on hundreds of patients with hyperventilation, panic, over anxious thoughts, and it has worked every time. Those around you may exacerbate what's going on because they're scared and worried for you. Remain calm, easy to say, but believe me, you are perfectly safe. It will pass. You will recover. You will not die. You will learn to control this. Practice as often as you need. You will overcome them. Go and enjoy your day. And as always, 